Yep. So we're going to lose that one. Ah, what a bummer. What a bummer. And I've lost all three of these. Darn. Okay, well, we'll we will get it right back, but what? What? We declare war again? No. We never trusted you for a second. <laughs> That's what we're saying to him. Come on. We were already fighting you. And you were the ones that begged for peace. What is up, my pylons? It's me, Gamer, Gamer Pile, and I am back with another episode of my Galactic Civilizations 3 Retribution playthrough. I am doing one of the, uh, what do they call those things? Campaigns. Why can I never remember that word? Holy cow. I'm doing one of the campaigns, and as you can perhaps surmise, if you're familiar with the layout of this game, it's not going very well. Uh, more on that in a minute. I've got my drink right here, my handy dandy notebook, my pen to write down any handy dandy notes, and most importantly, I have you. Thank you. Thank you so much for being here today. I appreciate it. I appreciate you. I appreciate all of our latest subscribers, too. You are amazing helping us get that push to 400 subs. Are you going to be the one that puts us over the top? That would be incredible because when you do, I've got a pretty sweet video to, that I'm going to show you with some food, which... You're going to want to see it, folks. Let's just leave it at that. And golly! And as my friend Gomer Pyle would say, I, he's not really my friend. I wish that I had known Jim Neighbors. I did not. Anyways, um, uh, last time we decided, or we, we, we had it decided for us that everyone was going to attack us. There's only two nations not at war with us. The Drenjin, whom uh, they're only not at war because we were at war, then had peace, and now we're no longer at war. And the Iridium Corporation, who love us for some reason. Um, I'm not sure why, but they do. They really like us. I mean, I, can, I know why. They're all the reasons you see right down there. But anyways, the Altarians were our friends, and then suddenly they hated us, and now they're at war with us. And yeah, so is everybody else. So what have we been doing about that? Well, as you can tell uh, from the HUD here... We actually are in a mock-up of the Milky Way galaxy, or at least some type of spiral galaxy. And we are uh, uh, clowns to the left of me, jokers to the right. This, These guys right now are not at war with me, but the people on the other side of them in this little sliver of orange you can see. I'm this bluish, the darker of the two blues. This orange guy is at war with me. I have not yet met this green guy. So he's not at war with me either, I guess, technically. And these are my friends up here to the north. I'm currently doing my best to stake my claim to some of this land here. These planets are the ones that I'm going after, and that's what we're going to make for our goal today. I'm just trying to maintain over on my eastern front. This is the Altarians. They are this teal blue, and they definitely, definitely... I think it's like 6 to 1 in terms of power or something like that. 600, 2800. Oh, it's more. It's more. It's almost, almost ten. If I, how many? Six times? Five? No, five times. They're five times. I can math. They're almost five times stronger than us. Just about five times stronger than us. Oh, these guys are coming out. These guys are just, they're pirates. The white, this light white one here. They're pirates. They're pains in my butt is what they are. Oh, yes. We were going to take this guy too and hope nobody comes to attack us. My goal is to fill up everything. Uh, fill, uh, fill up this as much as possible. I am going to go ahead and... No, that's going to take me another turn. I can always destroy that later. Which is what I will do. Now I have... Now I will have all of these ships to hopefully take out... Oh, wow. Nelly. All of these ships are weak, but there's so many of them. Holy cow. I can't really take care of this guy. I can't take this guy out because I need someone to stay back. and So I guess that's not going to work. The problem is I just, I have so few ships. There's so few ships. Everything I everything I get goes to the front lines because I was so behind uh, building them. So now I have to play catch up and try and defend against multiple points of entry. Wait a second. Pirate defender, where the heck is he going? Oh, he's going to go kill my things? Come on, man. I ain't got time for that. Ain't nobody got time for that. That is 200, 200 uh, credits every single one of these you destroy. Maybe he'll come after me instead. Oh, I'll totally get him. I will I will destroy him. But man, what a pain. And this one right here. 
Is that right next to my... Oh, no, that's his. That's actually his shipyard. This, the guy that I'm fighting up here. It must have been... Must have been I must have taken over these two planets, and that's what did it. Noise. Okay. Okay, what are you doing, dude? It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what you're doing, because... These guys are... These guys are mine. Let's remove... Eject, eject, eject. Let's remove those first, because I, w I don't want a chance losing them. They're my these take forever to build, and I don't want a chance losing them. So we've got six here. Victory certain, it says. Uh, I appear to have 95 defense on the shields, which is what most of their ships are. Oh, boy. Here we go. Oh, I did lose a ship. Ah, oh, darn. Oh, wait, did I? I don't know that I did. So I could... Okay, so here's another thing. I could attack with this, or I could just try and wait to see what would happen. One, two, three, because I want to kill you. Definitely going to kill you. And then we'll see what I do after that. Um, I, I feel like... One, two, three. I could actually go through and, and not have to attack him if he is in sufficient rebellion. Oh, I should have... I should have killed this. Well, I'll kill this first. Come back for that. Yes, that's what I'll do. Then he'll have to send new ships down. Um, and let's see. Let's give this one turn and see how well it. Seven of eight. One, two, three, four. Wait, one, two, three, four. That would be five, actually. Six, seven. So I'm going to go here. And I am going to skip the rest of your turn. So what that's going to do is I'm going to see how much rebellion I can get that guy into each turn. That's a defeat likely. Definitely not going to do that. Oh! Oh, I've got some friends coming to dinner. I'm having an old friend for dinner. So I actually have to play it kind of tight because I'm going to have to be able to get both of them at once, right? This guy moves eight. This guy moves nine. I move nine as well. So I'm going to actually come up here, hope that they don't split their forces. That would be... That would be what I would do. Send him this way and these two down here where I, it couldn't be helped. But I'm coming back here with this guy. This guy. So I will actually have defenses on the south. So, okay. I'm actually safe there. I'm really worried about how many ships this guy is sending up here right now, though. I and mean, look at this. These are their troop transports. We're not at war with them right now. Right now. Oh. I also just noticed I could do that. Why wouldn't I do that? 36 for the MM. Oh, that's the medium one. That's not even the big one. Maybe I should build a couple more. I can connect these ones. So that each of these now gives me more. I'm also checking my credits right above me here. Oh, look it. Oh, look it. Oh, but it's 0%. How is that possible? 0% in Rebellion, but its its influence is 1.3x. I guess that's not as much. I have 1.3 times as much influence on that that hex as he has. I think that's how that is computed. Um, so I've got two guys here. I'm going to kill him with that. Kill the, him with that, hopefully, or maybe the other guy if I need to. And this one will get him on the next turn. Okay. Whew. Whew. Kill. Oh, I'm not, that's the Iridiums. Oh, these are my friends. These are my friends. Oh, you guys can set those up anywhere you guys want. Really, you're lovely people. <laughs> Please stay low. Please like me. Please don't hurt me. Where is this? Where is this at? This is way in the back. But you know what I'm going to need? You know what I'm going to need soon is a colony ship. I'm going to need a colony ship. So I'm going to build a colony ship. That's going to take 21 turns. This was a medium. Okay. He's coming right up here right away. I just That's where I want him to be in case Altaria attacks me again. Hey, you know what? Let's actually check. Oh, no. This was still the same turn. I was going to say, let me check um, to see how much he lost in terms of... Uh, power. Let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. He can go that far, eh? So I'm going to go right here and and waste the rest of my turn. <clears throat> and that should work. Oh, these are pretty close too, actually. Those are pretty close. Yeah, those are pretty close. Idle ship, eh? Idle ship, eh? Oh, right, right. We were going to do this. Oh, yeah. I've got that one in the bag. Yikes. Okay, so that's a 1% rebellion now. Now I'll see. So this is 39, oh, 38, 43. Oh, it's going up even faster now. Oh, oh, and we're taking our time. We're t 
We're, we're taking our turns, I should say. Yeah, look at that jerk. Yeah, I'm destroying all these jack holes. <laughs> idle ship where? This guy's idle. I got my moves back. Um, <clears throat> But I don't actually have to worry about him. Oh, he didn't move? He didn't move. Well, we're going to... I'll have two over here just in case. That seems like a good idea. Idle ship. Oh. Wait, they didn't even move? Why didn't they move? All right, well, I'm going to hang here then and let him swing lower. And if either of them make a move, well, here I am just in case. Same with this guy. Same with this guy. Let me just make sure I'm clear on my southern front. Oh, I've got company. The KSS Shaper. Oh, that's a really cool design. I'm not going to lie. That's a really cool looking ship for, for a constructor. That's what that symbol is. Oh, as a matter of fact, it's actually... It's the icon of all the constructors, regardless of what race you are. It looks like it's a top-down view of that ship. Oh, that's really cool. I'm not going to lie. I, that's really cool. I don't know if that was in Galsiv 2 or not, but uh, I approve this message. So that gave me 1%. This gave me 47 and 40. Let's go on over. Kill this thing because it's just ticking me off. Victory likely. Yeah, we'll do that next turn. All right. Maybe we'll just skip to that. Okay, so here we go. Uh, <laughs> moment of truth. Um, I also am actually down a couple of hit points from when I attacked the Altarians here. I didn't even realize. But let's see what we can do to this here bad guy. Oh, we did beat him. Okay, cool. Oh, down to 10 hit points, though. Well, that, that's no bueno. That's not going to quite make it either. But we are up to, like I said, 51% and 43% with the three ships defending. This is only this is only going up one percentage point per turn at the moment. It's two. It, it is 2.6 per times the influence I have over them. The, there is a sentence there almost. Oh, hello. Where might you be going? I've got to keep you around. I'm going to keep this around up here so that I can hopefully take this out. Oh, it's just the one, though. It's just the one. That's not a big deal. Let's go ahead and also check our border. I took care of this mess over here. They stood there. They, like, froze there for a turn and a, a turn. And then the one only went about a little bit when it saw my other ship coming up from the bottom. So, oh, well. We're going we're gonna to go back to exploring because we're explorers. This ship's returning here. This ship's returning here. And now we've got our planets defended. All is well on the Western Front. I know, I know. It's all quiet on the Western Front. I'm just saying. And this guy. Okay, good. So I'm actually... Is this a... What type of starbase is this? Specialization culture. So I, I, I need to make a mining base over here then. So that, so that I can get this, um, my, this crystal. Let's see if I can't. Because I am... I don't know where he's going. How many, how many moves does he have, by the way? Has seven moves. Oh, that's not bad. I can catch up to him real quick. With my plus one more move than he has. I'm trying to figure out if I could attack this and be safe. Oh, it's going to be tricky. Because I'm down to 11 hit points. Ooh, boy. It says victory certain, but I don't know if that's true. I had better... Oh, gosh. Look at that. Uh... Oh, gosh. <laughs> Let's see if that makes it go up faster now. 46%. And then we're going to send him over. He's He is going to earn himself a well-deserved holiday after we take out this, this, this guy. Where are we even going to hide you, dude? I don't know. I don't know where we're going to even put him. I wish that one of these was already there. Already, that's only a class 5, man. That's only a class 9. This is only a class 5. So if we've got junk planets, but we're going to get them, but they're junk planets, which is kind of too bad. Class 8. Class 12. Mm -hmm. Class 10 right there. Class 10 is about where things get good. Class 20 is the highest, I think, that they have the game. All right. So now... Oh, and the other thing here. I decided I was going to leave this alone because we are hurting. A couple of our guys here. 10 of 12, 6 of 12. Oh, they're going up 2 per turn. 30 of 43, 12 of 12. These guys are fine. 42, that's fine too. But I'm going to give them a couple turns rest. Then we're going to come down here and take care of this jerk hole. And then we'll come back. I also don't want to attack this. I wanted to see how much longer. I moved him further away too, just so I don't get surprised by someone coming out of there. I moved him further away. 
Oh, yes, we've got one. We've got another one, folks. I I, I, I had this one here. Nope. I had. Where, where'd he go, George? Which way did he go? This one. I'm sending him up here to this middle planet, this outpost of a planet. This one's getting a little bit more support already. It's not good, but it's getting better. That middle one definitely needs one. This is going to be... This one's this one's bad, and actually, I should probably, I should probably take care of that. I should really probably take care of that because that is, that's right on the front, man. What are we doing with you? Where are you going? You know what? Go this way. Go this way instead. I'm just moving through, snaking through the nebulae. Nebulae. Hey. I don't know why I said that either. Having, oh wait, you know what though? Having this fourth. Having this fourth transport gives you a much better shot at this class 15 planet. So perhaps once I get that one up there, especially if this is still at 0% rebellion, perhaps that's when I'll attack. Let's go ahead and, and fast forward to that uh, right now. Well, this is interesting. We didn't even really do a whole lot against the Altarians in terms of fighting back, but they're asking us for peace. Now, if I say no, there's no chance that I will be able to do it later on, like through the trade menu. And we can always attack him again later when we're a little bit more prepared. I'm going to go ahead and accept it. Let our flanks be fine. Oh, yeah. And we met um, Hethasius or whatever. You could use your help. It provide us with Iconian Refuge. Missile Augmentation. No, I can't do that, brah. Uh, we just met him this past turn. That must mean, must mean he's got a ship here somewhere that we can see. I don't know where. I've killed off the thing there. We're going to go to this planet to rest and repair. And I'm going to continue on because we haven't we haven't gotten anywhere. <laughs> we haven't gotten anywhere with this thing here. It's still way over here. <laughs> I've got to give the, the game credit. It knew that I was poised to take all of these worlds anyway. I mean, I know I'm going to get them eventually, but I was going to take out this shipyard, for example. I was going to capture this level 15 planet class 15 planet which is now in zero percent rebellion i might have to just go and attack it again i might have to do that because i really want that one especially um and in addition this one shipyard that i've got here that i that i had uh, not destroyed because i don't have a ship strong enough to do that or i didn't is now building a transport right next to two completely unguarded uh planets here if i had not brought this up exactly when i did then we would be having trouble. And even as it is, I may still lose. Oh, because it's defended by two ships. <sighs> oh, boy. Oh, good Lord. That was that was a good thing. Okay. All right. So at least that threat is destroyed and gone. I actually have a nice little ship here. And uh, a transport that just got built. And I'm going to eject it. And I'm going to get all, all of them that I can. Oh, I should have done it through here, through the shipyard. That would have made more sense. Eject. Now I can get... Ah, I've got six now. Dang. That's a lot of troops on here. Holy cow. Once they're on here, I can do whatever I want with them. But, yeah, that's pretty sweet. Maybe I should send them to a couple other worlds. <laughs> All right. My next target. I was thinking about swinging from the south. But I've already got inroads up here in the northeast. So why wouldn't I do that? 9% in rebellion for that dude. 0% here. I'm going to go ahead and start building or, or sending them up north. I already I did bring these other four transports up as well. It's um it's going to take a while. It's going to take a while, but eventually I'll get to the point I need I need more logistics and I need a stronger a stronger mass driver weapon. Those are the two things I need the most. I do have a third ship now in here with us. Oh, I didn't want to go that way. I meant to go up. Darn it. <laughs> I've used almost all of my almost all of my moves now. This one, what were you going to do? Is there a ship there? We've got a ship there now? Oh, man. 82% rebellion. I better take care of this ship first. We're only up to 17 hit points on this guy. But once those two join forces... Oh, look it. We just opened up some new stuff here. I can see clearly now. The haze is gone. The fog is gone. The fog of war, as it were. Quick battle this guy. Cannot wait until that thing is defeated. Man, I hate these darn pirate bases. They're like, they are the worst. I hate them. 
Could you be upgraded to anything? Four, thirteen, sixteen. I, I don't think so. Thirteen, six. You know, what? I'm gonna go off camera for a second. I'm gonna see if I can't improve this actual design. That might be good. So we'll design this ship, and this guy, four, thirteen, six. Yeah. Let's no forty-two, forty-eight. So I have six. I do have six. Yeah, it actually worked out. I gave it a pretty significant overhaul. We switched from missiles to mass drivers and kept the same amount of attack, but we actually doubled the amount of missile defense we have now. So, yeah. Let's go with this guy and obsolete this guy. That's much better. That's much, much better. The only concern I have is what if... Well, you know what? Yeah, why don't we do that? I want to upgrade this guy. This is the one. 2,000 to upgrade it. Holy cow. That's a lot of upgrade cost. We'll start up here with the the ones that are on the... Um... Oh, you know what? It's fun. That's actually We actually have more attack now. We have two more attack than we did before. Um, it's going to be expensive to do this, but it's going to be so worth it. So worth it. Well, the first one has fallen. That's good. Planet Zakara 2 must be right here. Zakara 2, barely habitable. Nice. <laughs> Why don't we go ahead and upgrade those factories to mega factories? That's going to take all day. A day and a half. Molecular fabricator. Well, what's this now? Uh, colonies manufacturing and research. Oh. Fancy. So what should we put? What else should we put here then? Ooh, what to do, what to do. We'll build one bank, and then we'll actually start in with our engineering skills here. I guess I will build that. This should fall sh relatively soon, I hope. This one is its actually kicking up to 10%, so that's a good sign. And this guy here, still 0%. I don't know. I don't know that we're going to be able to get this one. And what a shame that is, because that is such a beautiful, ripe, class 15 planet. I do have a colony ship, though, that in two turns is going to get this guy, Piru Parka. Piru Parka. So that's good. It's I finally claimed this a few turns ago. Well, maybe 10, 15 turns ago. The um, territory of the... Is this like Conians? The Iridium Corporation. Uh, had kind of snuck down to like this area. So uh, that's, uh, that's cool that that's done. I'm actually going to use this ship here as defense for it. Because, you know, you never know what's going to pop up over here. That always bugs me. Uh, worries me. These border outposts. I don't want to lose them. But I also noticed... <laughs> I also noticed that I've got a couple of things happening over here. I'm gonna I'm gonna be able to bring up my yes these bad boys. They're gonna come up here. They're gonna be um, attacking post haste to eliminate any threat to the republic as soon as this guy heals. So maybe we should actually just hold them back here in reserve for now and call it a day. Let's call it a day. <laughs> Idle ship. Oh yes, and then the other cool thing is this guy. We're moving. We're moving up together. I'm gonna make this strong enough that I should be able to take out their shipyards. That's a kind of a big goal for me right now. Oh, I see what you're trying to do over there with your cargo hauler. Oh, and we got a little shippy guy down here. Oh, he's. <laughs> they they actually have some missiles. It's a good thing I've been preparing for this. I've been preparing for this my whole life. I love this game, man. I love. <laughs> I love being able to go and. Well, I could actually almost get him here. Victory likely. Victory certain. I'm going to bring him up. Let's go see if we can't take out this bad boy. Because he is a bad boy. My, uh... Oh, yeah, see, I don't get it. 15%. 0% on this one, though. That's weird to me. One ship defending. Victory certain. Um, It doesn't tell me how many ships are defending. But it does tell me victory is certain, so there must be ships defending, right? We are rocking toward a conquest of the Iconians. I mean, it will definitely take some time. They've got a lot of territory, but I am in a pretty good spot. Plus, I decided I'm, I am going to actually do at atmospheric cleansing. To that end, I've added a couple of colony ships to my queues. There's one hanging out right in front of that guy. And I've actually got one down here, too. So where is that? Right here. So that's a level 20 and a level 18 planet that I'm going to get. The only problem is the Iconians have found their backbone and they've decided to attack me with 120. Oy, that's that's a lot of points. I don't think I'm going to save my, th save this particular planet 
it's in the middle of my I don't so this is weird. Like it's in the middle of my uh sphere of influence, so I don't think I'm gonna lose it. I know I'm not gonna lose it. I'm not gonna I will be able to easily reclaim it, I guess is what I'm trying to say. And in addition, fortunately, conveniently, uh, fortuitously, I've got a bunch of ships right here. So I'm gonna try and let's see how many how many moves you have. Five. Oh good. Saved by the fact that my engines are better. So I'm gonna try and bring all these guys in. That should be that should actually be sufficient to stop him. Oh man, I can't believe this could actually happen. Cause that's look at all the ships. The twenty three ships he's got going on, and one of them is a at least one of them one of them is a troop transport, which is gonna destroy destroy my stuff. And I brought you in just in time. Well, this guy's taking out my ships, which is freaking annoying. But uh, I brought you in just in time so, to see if I can capture this bad boy right here. Yes, and I do. Do I lose any ships? Oh, I lost a, I lost a ship. Dang, I lost a ship. I wasn't prepared for that. Okay, so that's good. And I've taken out... I, I've captured this whole area right here, which is pretty sweet. And I have also taking out their shipyard so they can't build any more ships in three turns i'm gonna have i can't believe i'm gonna have that and oh oh i do need to work on making some more administrators because i need to build some more ship uh, uh station things oh yeah so this guy here i want him to get this ascension crystal and some antimatter and a durantium and then i have another constructor that's coming up here I'd love for him to get definitely the manufacturing relic. Either the Durantium or the approval relic. I mean, my approval is pretty sweet, so I'm going to um, default to the Durantium. But we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. This guy's just going to have his going to get to have his way with me right now. But that's okay. And then I'm, I decided I'm literally going to just follow this guy around. Wait, how come he... Uh, I thought I upgraded him. There we go. That should do it. And then I've got some ingress down here that I'm not particularly a fan of. I might let him take care of this one. So I'll send I'll send these guys down this way. This one can come down too and see if I can't harass them a little bit before they get in here. I'm mostly worried about these constructors building something. The Altarians did that too. Flipping Altarians. Where'd they go? Uh, that's too far. Uh, over here. Oh, yeah. See, look at that. They've got this. They've got a military starbase here, and it's pretty well defended. I cannot destroy that right now. Oh, man. They just got these darn things for days. I'm following this one around, and they got two more of them over here. Who are you at war with that you're sending things all over? Uh, oh, okay. Oh, I can't talk about friendship. Our relations are too low. Turns out that's that's not enough to say, yes, we totally love you. <laughs> wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Oh, oh, my new colony's done. Wow, that's, they're all about the, uh, the research here. I'm going to do this, though. I'm going to destroy these. We're going to make some basic factories. And then, well, no, I don't even want to do that. Cancel that. Do this. Yeah, those can be. Wait, what's this? Population and wealth. So that will destroy... Uh, we'll cancel that one. And then we'll figure out what to do with that one when we cross that bridge. There are no real big shipyards around here, which is too bad. Um, we'll hold off for now. I can't even see him. Okay, so now with this one, I want to move this back a little bit so that it can't get attacked by the baddies. So we'll use the asteroids as a nice natural defense. Keep you here, and I'm going to have you guard. I've only got two of you left, but I do have another one. Yeah, there he is. There he is. He's going to make his way up here, and he's going to join ranks with us. Okay. Let's see about this. And we're almost... I know. I know it's running a little late today. I'm so sorry. We're going to we're gonna be done with the episode fairly soon. I just want to make sure I can destroy this. Oh, that was ever so close. Oh, and now there, this guy's coming up here, too. Oh, no. Okay. Things are things are starting to get a little bit interesting. I don't think I've got permanent issues, a colony ship, but you never know. 
So let's do this and this and see where that puts us. Victory uncertain. Yowzers. We've only got one more move. Oh, boy. So here's the question. Now, that's a lot of ships that I have here. One, two, three. That's a lot of ships I have here that are really expensive and take a long time to build. Do I risk it to save a class 12 planet that will that I'll be able to capture back pretty easily? Or do I regroup, ensure that I have enough ships to... Oh, man, even that. Even that. That's the only cargo hull there. Okay, everything else. Eight, eight attack on the beams. Yeah, that's... This is this is going to be a tough one. This is going to be a tough battle, and I'm a little frustrated by it. My, honestly, I'm I'm frustrated with myself that I've gotten myself into this mess. And that's what I'm frustrated about. What are you all doing down here? You know what? I am gonna I am gonna muster you. Come on, let's go. We're gonna take out this guy. This guy. One there. Juan there. And you can come down here and do some cleanup in aisle three. Aisle 2, I suppose. We'll call it Aisle 2. Uh, aisle 2, and then we've got to get rid of these constructors before... The, especially with that being a cons the, uh, an Ascension Crystal. And this guy's literally following it around for no purpose at all. 31% in Rebellion over here now. What have we got happening here? 0%. Well, they, have, they do have ships defending. Oh, that's not even the one. This one here, but still 0%. Still 0%, because that's how we roll. Nice, nice. Oh, and that's right. We did have a colony ship in Earth finish up. Now we're going to start going ahead and doing this. Even though it's going to take 93 turns, it's mostly I don't want to micromanage it anymore. I'm, I'm just, I'm not going to lie. Ten turns to get to there. So let's, yeah, let's go to there. Eleven turns. That is going to ruin this, actually, a little bit. I didn't think of that. The Snathy Homeworld. Nerp. The Snathy Homeworld. Yerp is over here research let's go ahead and build another basic lab right there then um ho 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 that's probably my best shipyard in terms of construction points and i never i never even destroyed this one i still not destroyed this one because i just i can't i can't get down there i don't have enough ships i don't have enough time I've got to destroy this. Let's see if we can do that. Oh, where is it going to go? If it goes in and takes that planet, takes that planet, I will be se severely put out. Did he not? Or do I just not have? Oh, I've got a ship here that is waiting. Okay, here it goes. Iridium Corporation, Crinsintegrate, Your Thalen, Iconians. Yep, so we're going to lose that one. Ah, what a bummer. What a bummer. And I've lost all three of these. Darn. Okay, well, well, we will get it right back, but what? What? We declare war again? No. We never trusted you for a second. <laughs> That's what we're saying to him. Come on, we were already fighting you. And you were the ones that begged for peace. Victory is likely if I attack with these. I think I think I I mean I have to kind of go ahead and do that. They're making their way down. It would be really helpful if I had another. So send right here. We'll send right here. So at least we have a few ships working out for us. Okay. Okay. There goes nothing. That's a lot of ships. Oh, they've got us all the way down to just two remaining. At least they're my two good ones. And they are currently at full hit points. So I'm going to actually send them around the corner here. So that I can if even... I, I would like to go take that out, frankly. I really would. One, two, three. That was, that was four. Okay. Oh, man. Well, that you know, that's probably a good place for us to stop. Why? Why are you attacking me now? Why? We're going to eject that ship. Send you this way. I need to go up here and destroy this guy. I'm assuming he's going to come this way. I don't honestly know. 
But, oh, he's running away. He's he's hightailing it. He knows I'm about to come kick his turkis. Yeah, we're going to kick his turkis right now. This turn, we're going to kick his turkis. Turkis. We're going to kick his turkis. Kick his turkey. <laughs> All right, that's probably a good place for us to stop. We did manage to defeat the huge fleet that was attacking us. Next turn, we're going to recapture this planet. We really do want it. It's a class 12, and that will be good. This is a class... I don't know what class that is. I, I guess I haven't actually explored that area yet. It's at the border of my territory. The new border of my territory. This stupid thing. We're going to get rid of that first. And it wouldn't be swell if we could take out this guy down here because he's attacking again. He's attacking again. Okay, so I can go here. I think that's the last... Yeah, that's as far as I can go. Bugger. We'll also, next turn, one turn away from having a bunch of new high-class planets... That's probably a good thing, right? I mean, I'd say so. So you're not going to want to miss that one. Go ahead, hit those uh, like and subscribe buttons down there. You'll see plenty of great videos at these links right here. Awesome, awesome, awesome content. Obviously, because it's yours truly. I'm going to go ahead and pretend that I'm not humble at all. Uh, yeah, I probably am not humble at all. But I'm going to try. I'm going to try to be humble. I better myself every day. As always, my pylons last but not least. I don't know either. <laughs> Stay safe and be well.